Good morning, guys. Just woke up. I can't even remember my eyes yet, but it's like 7, 7 05. Uh, I just got up so I can upload my YouTube video that I made the other day. I'll pop in the shower, drink some coffee, make some food, and to work. I'm running late. Okay, so uh, I kind of like being late sometimes actually because it forces you to just get moving. Your adrenaline kicks in, you're awake, and it almost starts, <clears throat> excuse me, it almost starts your day a little bit better. So here I go, baby. What's up guys, just got done the morning training, train Nick, then I train myself. Uh, just going over a quick tip that really helps you guys stay in check with your nutrition and that is simply you have to put your meals in containers and do the meal prep because if you don't, you're going to either go to a convenience store or you're going to go through the pantry and you're gonna just do something that's quick and easy and unhealthy and it's gonna stray you off of the path to your goal. So really big tip is just do the bulk cooking, get them in containers and then you have the meals ready to go and they're healthy and you're gonna feel better about it. Up. Good, back. Up. Good. Come on. Come on. Push. Two. That's it. Up, 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 up. Three. Four. Come on. Five. Football season is coming, baby. Let's go. Keep your butt up. Keep your butt up. Time to be a lion. Come on. Eat and pray. Go. Get another one. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. These are the hardest ones. Let's go. Get up. Get up. Come on. One minute left. <laughs> All right, pull. Good. Down. Now, Justin, when you get to the top, just drop the bar. Don't put it down. Okay? Stay tight. Up. Good. Drop the bar. Nice. Good. So what happened last night? What happened with the snatch is what I'm talking about. I don't know. I'm afraid to get under the bar. Why are you afraid to get under the bar? I don't know. So we got to conquer that shit, right? Yes. I'm not swinging next week. Yes. Promise. Promise. Full steam ahead. Yes. Under. Elbows. 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 Good. Okay. Let's go. Come on. Let's make it happen now. Aggressive. Yeah! Nice! Front foot, back foot. Okay, so I'm walking into the Barnes & Noble. I just got done at the vitamin shop. I really need to get better at vlogging in public. I get nervous and I get afraid to do it because I think people are gonna look at me. But anyway, hitting the Barnes & Noble. Gonna go get some book knowledge. Love hanging out at this place.
It's got the four hour work week by Tim Ferriss. I feel like any business owner, entrepreneur, uh, has to read it at some point. So I watch a lot of his podcasts, but I've actually guiltily have never read the book. So I'm just gonna read anyway. I probably know a lot of the concepts by now, but hey, knowledge is power. All right, so real quick, I just wanna explain my love for candles. Got one there, <laughs> and I got one over here. Now the thing is with candles, true story. One time, I almost burnt down the entire house with a candle, I swear to God. Uh, it was, all right, you know what? Next time, I will tell you that story. However, it is so damn hot in here. It's the candles. They smell so good. Whenever I'm recording a video with it facing me, all of a sudden, my $800 plus dollar iPhone decides to go. Come on, Apple. What is the deal? Question that I often get all the time, even though I've answered it about 10 times now on video. Why don't you guys just go watch the previous videos that I've made? But I'll answer it again. Question goes something like this. Hey man, I'm looking to get super strong or get into the gym. What supplement should I take? My answer, take them all. Take all the steroids you can get. Drink all the protein shakes. Take your BCAAs, the testosterone boosters. While you're at it, throw in some spinach. And I can guarantee you that in one week, your bench is gonna go from 135 to 400 and Seven days. <laughs> yeah, I hope you guys didn't follow what I just said because that's not gonna work. My friends, unfortunately the supplement that you're looking for, you are not going to find on the aisle at the vitamin shop. That supplement is labeled hard work. And I'm sorry to break it to you, my generation and millennials, people that are younger than me, it's going to take work and effort over a long period of time. Now, the supplement talk. Supplements do work, but they are such a small percentage of what gets the results. You have to be putting in the hard work first to actually get benefits of supplements. And supplements take time to really notice a change, unless you're taking anabolic steroids, which that is a completely different video. But for right now, what I'm talking about is supplements that you would get in the grocery store or the vitamin shop, which I just came from. So now, I'm gonna show you what I take and the benefits that I use them for. So those are the only supplements that I'm currently taking. Beyond that, you have to make sure that you're eating right, okay, and training towards the goals that you're looking for. Then implement the supplements once those two things are solidified and you're on an awesome training and eating uh, regimen. Went to Barnes & Noble this evening, picked up the infamous four hour work week by Tim Ferriss. If you own a business or you're an entrepreneur, you have either read that book or you are going to read that book after this video. Another book that I've read that really has helped me along my journey is The Four Agreements. When I was in high school, this book definitely influenced me to chase my dreams. The Last Lecture, Randy Pausch, true story. This is great for business owners or anybody who's in customer service or just anybody who's involved with people in general, which is pretty much everyone. How to Hug a Porcupine teaches you the ways to master all different personalities. The Proof of Heaven by Evan Alexander. Dude literally dies and comes back and talks about his experience in the afterworld. Warrior of Light, because I'm not a warrior of darkness by Paul O.C., who also is the author of The Alchemist. Tools of the Titans by Tim Ferriss. Pretty much just an accumulation of all his podcasts condensed into one book. Awesome. Got this when I was in, I wanna say, eighth grade. The Ultimate Bodybuilder Book by Joe Weider. This thing changed my life, and there's a lot of ripped dudes in bikinis in there, and some girls who have bigger chests than I do. But they've all shaped me or influenced me in some way. So, knowledge is power, guys. Go out there, invest in yourself, enter an interest, read some books, comics, whatever. It will help you down the road.